Two men have been shot dead in Dublin in what appears to have been a gangland kill. Most of us have a reasonable idea of what the near-death experience or MDE the MW is. car, which guardians suspect may have been linked to the attack, was found abandoned. Uh, um, I asked the light if I could uh, spend time with it. Mm -hmm. I just had question after question, infinite amount of questions that were answered to my so satisfaction. You then float out of your body, seeing it from above, and head towards a tunnel, and you enter the tunnel. I was simply dead for 14 weeks. No, not at all. My life is a continuum and has expanded. Once I went to the light and got the truth, I really got it and I'll never lose it. I saw bright lights shining in all directions. I love that. I love that you said that. At the far end of the tunnel is a bright light, but as you get close to the light, you are met by somebody already dead who tells you that to our prosaic planet with other earthlings. Well, before I died, I, I didn't, I'd never heard the word near death. I'd never been into metaphysics or hospice or anything. I knew nothing of all that. But I'm um, uh, um, surprised when you see and Ken Ring pointed out and that, uh, with, uh, piece of, uh, of was that the experience was interactive, just as l the life you're living right now is interactive. Oh, there's no doubt in my mind that we're all connected in some kind of mad cosmic But neither belief is correct. While you're on the other side, what, what is the main thing that you learned or that you'd like to share with us? The classic out-of-body experience. I got back into the, the tube and went hurtling down the tunnel, knowing that at the end of it, and the visual thing was shards of glass. In a nutshell, common uh, beliefs to are that the pain. NDE, near death experience, NDE. happens only to those who are dying and also yeah, so I that is uh, uh, Mr. Miller, are you in right there? Right now, today, on the planet, we have the most healers in history are alive, the most therapists are alive, the most modalities are ever. Our relator this morning following the latest to gangland style killing in South Dublin. If you want help, you can find it inside or out, anywhere. It happened shortly after 10 o'clock last night. Oh, I definitely think that in some kind of superficial way, I've been thoroughly healed of all that I've suffered before. It's said to happen when you are in the actual process of dying and you hear strange noises, then feelings of blissful peace and joy sweep over you. Your death experience is... Two men were shot dead while sitting in a parked car. Uh, ...that uh, go to the light to be completely interactive with it and... Uh, I entered a crazy, crazy white tunnel. <laughs> and I, I look back at some of the things I, I used to do back then, I can't even believe that was me. I see myself as a survivor. Uh, in this second chance of life, I now think that I've been given this chance to do good. Near-death experiences are not always related to death, despite the D in NDE. How long was he technically dead? Three days. For example, the training of combat fighter pilots can involve high G-forces in a centrifuge, which sends the blood away from the brain to the feet, leading to unconsciousness. Uh, by the way, I don't hold the record for being dead by any means. Um, there have been people who have been dead a lot longer than I have. But the near-death experience became really popular only in 1975. Without a doubt, there is an afterlife. Well, the lower part had been split open. Uh -huh. They were the splitting open the trunk of the body, uh -huh. and he opened his eyes. Well, that's really kind of like a natural response. So the doctors didn't think anything of it. Do you believe in hell? If you do, you're not alone. It kept going, you know, a natural response of the body, a, re a reflex. Right. And they kept cutting, and he opened his eyes again. All my faculties were still there. 
And then I became aware that I wasn't looking at the parked silver Lexus car when gunmen opened fire. Operating table, and I was way above looking down. And again, they didn't think anything of it, closed his eyes, kept cutting, and uh, about halfway up the trunk now, opened his eyes for the third time. How long were you with them? Uh, well, if you're around the coach, I was to get out of the car to make an escape. It would be the best thing to do. And the head of autopsy screamed, stepped backward, and had to take a two-month vacation. Now, we don't know exactly what causes a near-death experience simply because the brain is so fiendishly complicated. And I had this and incredible, had this incredible experience, experience of, of, of moving up moving into, up a, into a, a, misty a misty sort of area, area and then becoming aware that I was in the tunnel. Like, uh, that they went there, they believed they were meeting someone that they uh, knew and trusted. That's a special hour on Hell, next Friday. Two men, it appears that they were lured uh, to this particular area because this is a cul-de-sac.